<laughs> hey, this is uh, Isabella. She's our detail manager. Wow, these lights really make my forehead look shiny. Ew. Okay, I'm gonna take a video for you in here since it's nice and illuminated. Do a little bit better of a walk around this time. Tires have plenty of tread. A little rock chip right there, but that's nothing a Sharpie won't fix. Exterior looks really good. Now these are like really bright lights, so they show like everything, which is good. That's what you want to see, right? Now, let's take a peek on the inside. I know we kind of did this already, but it was a very hot day and I had searched for this car <laughs> forever and I was like, not having it. So I just want to give you a little bit more in depth look. This is just their cleaning stuff. It's still a little wet, it feels like. If it's still there after it dries, I'll just get it cleaned. It's not a big deal. Ah. Okay. So, inside. Really, inside looks great. I mean, exterior and interior, I'm giving them a 9 out of 10. You know, it's not perfect, but it's a used car. It's never going to be perfect. Looks like there's a little scratch up here on here. Maybe someone, I don't know, put something there. My mom has a freaking chunk taken out of her dash because one day we were picking up um, gutters and the uh, end of a gutter, super sharp, and we like stuck it through the back and it hit her dash and just sh like, glided through it like butter. It's crazy. Okay, car, running, driving, no lights. Excellent. Backup camera, operational. Oil temp, good. <laughs> You know, I'm kind of glad it's a little gloomy today because I am so tired of 100 degree days. I like the orange trim on everything, by the way. With the black, it just looks slick. Slick and sick. Now, let's hope those other people aren't over here because they're gonna look at this and be like, oh, that's the one we still want. And then they won't buy the gray one from the other salesman. So we're showing them the white and the gray one and we're just, I'm just trying to keep this one out of view from him. That's why I went and grabbed it from detail too. Normally I do the walk around in front of the building, but it's kind of an F you to the face when they came here to look at this and then <laughs> I'm doing a video on it. Okay, so I'm gonna do half throttle. Oh yeah, that engine sounds healthy. Shifts good, okay. We're gonna hit the brakes kind of hard. Brakes are nice and good. There was no vibration or any pulling in the steering. Steering feels really nice and tight too. It's not loose or anything. I'm gonna try to center it up on this road. Hit the brakes. So as you can see, it's not pulling or doing anything weird. Now I'm gonna hit these dips up here kind of hard. There's a dip this way and a dip that way. Um, this will cause the body to contort and twist. If there's anything loose or wrong, it'll pop and creak and do weird stuff. Sweet. So it just sounded like air going through a rod, which is basically what your shock is. Well, liquid, but makes a similar noise. So we're gonna do a hard left here. No clicking or popping. Now we're gonna do a hard right. This tests your CV axles. Again, no clicking or popping. So now we're gonna do full throttle. And brakes again. Feels great. So let's recap. Steering feels good. Brakes feel good. Suspension feels good. Uh, transmission feels healthy. Uh, engine also sounds healthy. And all your cruise control stuff, like we don't need to worry about that. That's all part of safety. They check all that stuff to make sure it works. Because we're not selling cars out here with, you know, stuff that doesn't work. Because that's so fun. 
Now I'm going to pop it back on State Street. And honestly, I'm surprised how nimble this thing feels. I'm having fun right now. Whee! Okay, we are going to get it up to speed. That was one more good test. So that was full throttle up to 50, hard brakes. Now there's gonna be a metal grate I'm gonna hit here so it will be loud, it is not the car. There we go, not too shab. If there's anything else you need, just let me know. But aside, Robbie out.